what's up everybody welcome back to my channel uh, today I'm just gonna be doing a little video um, I was gonna do a bad review but uh, I've been feeling under the weather this past couple days so haven't been able to do that but stay tuned another bad review is coming up soon but today I just wanted to do a little bag review on the bag that I have and a what is in my bag video so you'll be seeing uh, my bats that I have uh, my glove, my shoes, and all the other knickknacks that I have in my bag. So, here we go. Alright everybody, so the bag I have, the one that I use, is the Alpha Prime roller bag. I got the AP for Alpha Prime. Um, it does come with these over the shoulder straps, which I have on there for the time being because sometimes I like to carry it on my back, sometimes I like to roll it really comes in handy and is super comfortable probably the most comfortable roller bag that I have that comes with straps um, I did have the DeMarini Spec Ops bag which I took the straps off right away so this bag comes with a side pocket down here I got me just a charger for my phone you know because sometimes I do go live Gotta have that charger just in case my phone gets slow on battery. And the other thing I got, man, baby powder. If you know, you know why you need this and why it's important. And then you move up here, it has a spot to hold two bats. I got one in here. Uh, the only issue that some people may find with these bags is it doesn't go all the way down. It only stops about right here which keeps the handle up a little bit I personally don't mind it at all um, I like it uh, moving on to this side it's got another same setup as the other side there's a pocket down here um, I got me some ankle brace and a, a knee brace so I never know when I'm gonna need those and then here this pocket zips all the way down. I got me a towel in here. It's a nice uh, spot for your phone to keep your phone. And just some other knickknack pockets down here. I got me some athletic tape. Moving to the bottom zipper of the bag is where I got my shoes. Uh, I got these for it was either my birthday or Valentine's Day. I can't remember. Because Valentine's Day is in February, my birthday is in March. Uh, so, I've had these for about a year, super comfortable. Um, I got some wide feet, and these ones fit my feet very well. I did have the other New Balance ones, um, and they were just too snug, too tight on my feet. These ones, if you got bigger feet and looking for a shoe, these New Balance, uh, super comfy. Move it to the top. Has an easy zipper on the top, easy get to for your bats, where your bat goes. And this is a zipper right here, connects. So this one opens up where you keep your glove, and on the top, you can easily slide to get your bats. So first, go over what I got in here. Got me a weighted ball for when I first get to the field and want to throw and warm up. I usually use a weighted ball. I got me a skull cap that I use under my mask when I pitch because I usually tend to sweat a lot under there and sweat gets in my eyes, but this thing really helps. Um, gotta have one of these. Gotta always protect the McNuggets, man. Always. And uh, my glove, I got uh, from an MVP award. Um, it's made by Bayou Sports, BYS Bayou Sports. Big shout out to them. When I first got this glove, it was really stiff. I was kind of worried that it wouldn't break in right, but man, it feels really good. It's a 13 and a half inch. Some people say it looks like a 14 inch, which it does, but overall, man, super impressed with it, and I like it a lot. Boom, and up here, where your bats are, uh, you got this little pocket, uh, I got me some fingernail clippers, a marker, uh, 
to mark my balls. And got this little thing, it's pretty cool. I uh, use it when I go live. Put my phone here, wrap it around the fence. Really holds up great. It's got like a rubby uh, texture to it. Twists and holds pretty easy. Yeah, I like this thing a lot. Next, uh, I got my shin guards. They are hockey shin guards, but super comfy. They're the Easton Stealth shin guards. Uh, 16 inches, they cover all the way from your ankle to the top of your knee with the sided um, extra padding. Super lightweight, durable, easy to move in. And yeah, I recommend these if anybody's looking for uh, shin guards as a pitcher. Next, moving on to my bats. For ASA, I have a Monster Fallout. This thing is stupid hot. Anybody's looking for an ASA bat, anything Monster, I highly recommend. Uh, mine is a 26 ounce. I love this. On the side here, got the OG red knob DC 41 this thing has a lot of field wear but man she's still got a lot of gas in the tank and it's fire the next bat I got is a pure integrity with the Vux grips Vux grips however you want to pronounce it uh, this thing is very nice I like it a lot a lot of my bats have the tapered handle uh, it's just a comfortable thing that I like. Uh, yeah, this thing is hot too. And then my next bat, I just did the review on it. In my first video is the Pure One Nation. Uh, this thing is still taking a while to break in, but uh, these two-piece Pures feel great. So, And then moving to the front right here. Uh, it's just an extra pocket. Uh, I got my... Whoop, Got my koozie, Modelo time, baby. Got me some Wilson glove conditioner. Thing is about empty, I believe. Yep, almost empty. Got to get me a new one. And I got me some zip ties that uh, I use on my face shield, keep it attached to my helmet. Last but not least, a zipper in the middle this is where I keep my lacrosse pitching mask. I got the gray face shield on there with the Indian headdress. Uh, this is the Cascade CPVR model. Uh, super comfortable. I like it a lot. Uh, you can tighten it and adjust it in the back. I kind of have been thinking about changing the decals on this yet, but I don't know what. So if anybody has any suggestions, uh, post it in the comments below. Let me know your ideas and I will consider all of them. Been really thinking about changing the, the design on here, so any idea helps. So, with all that being said, guys, thanks for watching today's video on my Alpha Prime bag and what I have in my bag. Don't forget to like and subscribe and uh, go give a follow my Instagram, SPS underscore warning shot. Uh, definitely follow that. I'll follow you guys back. Boom. We'll see you guys at the next video.